वेलकम वेलकम टू इंडियन अकाडमी फॉर ऑल इन दिस सेशन वी आर डिस्कसिंग अबाउट द मॉडर्न इक्विपमेंट्स यूज इन सर्वेइंग राइट सो हियर फर्स्ट वी हैव टू डिस्कस अबाउट ईडीएम व्हाट इज द ईडीएम इलेक्ट्रॉनिक डिस्टेंस मेजरमेंट इक्विपमेंट राइट सो नेक्स्ट वी हैव टू डिस्कस ऑटो लेवल डिजिटल लेवल टोटल स्टेशन ग्लोबल पोजीशनिंग सिस्टम राइट राइट सो फर्स्ट वी हैव टू डिस्कस अबाउट ईडीएम see here nowadays the separate edm is not very popular because ts is combined with the et and edm et and edm so here what is the et and what is the edm et means electronic theodolite edm means electronic distance measurement equipment right so here <coughs> nowadays edm is very popular if by in the uh, total station because here uh, the total station is combined with edm right so how it will uh, works see uh, before we are using light waves light waves as a target as a target right so what is the meaning of that for example here we will put our instrument right so here somewhere we have object right so if we want to find that is distance so here we need uh, one uh, what we can a stereo rod like a prism rod like a prism rod so here we want to find the uh, distance between a to b for example right so here we are putting our instrument directly with the help of one uh, uh, any instrument so directly we are targeting the object b right with the help of uh prism rod uh, like that right so any uh, stereo rod anything we are using right so here nowadays we are using only digital meters for example if we will use edm then we have to put uh, our prism rod here right so here with the help of edm directly we are sending the uh, waves magnetic waves right magnetic waves so here directly we are measuring this distance from a to b right so here <coughs> nowadays we are sending only electronic magnetic waves so previously we are sending uh, light waves light waves later we are sending radio waves radio waves so nowadays we are sending only magnetic waves because in with the help of magnetic waves the accuracy is very high the accuracy is very hi that's why we are sending nowadays only microwaves microwaves are <coughs> infrared carrier signal right clear next oh here for that we are using paro prism or prism rod as a reflector as a reflector right clear next look here this is the edm <coughs> hand held edm right hand held edm right this is the edm here we have uh we can um, by using hand we can uh, take from one place to another place right so here very handy because with the with the help of hand we can take from one place to another place very cheap and can be used with accuracy 10 mm keep in that mind with the help of edm we can calculate the values up to 10 mm up to 10 mm right useful for remote measurements like uh, contact wire etc right clear <coughs> leh levels see previously we are using a dumpy level tilting levels previously we are using dumpy level tilting level look here this is the tilting level this is the dumpy level right so here nowadays we are using only auto level because advanced one auto level is the advanced one right clear so here now most commonly used leveling instruments are auto level <coughs> so here auto level as name sounds it has a auto level compensator and corrects automatically if the instrument goes out of level within its range within its range simple see here auto level so automatically uh, it can compensate the uh, level it can be compensate the levels so that's why here we are getting accuracy values accuracy values because we are getting high accuracy values that's why we are preferring auto level nowadays right clear next 
with the auto level so what we done with that auto level means what is the use of auto level survey work can be done fast less chances of error right magnification available is more range is more uh, image is erect so less chances of error what is the meaning of that see look here what is the first point what is the first point so here we can done the uh, survey work very fastly right so here less chances for error error uh, the chance of error or the sources of errors are less right magnification available is more right so here we can observe the object very clearly very clearly with the telescope with the telescope next range is more range is more what is the meaning of that see for example here we have point a here we have somewhere we have point b so here we if i want to calculate the distance or otherwise i want to do level from a to b right so previously if we will use a tilting level or a dumpy level we can use for only small distances small distances if the distances are very large or very more then also we can use a tow level that is the meaning of that range is more right image is erect so less chances of error means so object may be we can erect easily right because magnification is very high means magnification means here simple the <coughs> the image the image may be uh, may be clearly vision from the or through the telescope right clear next digital level <coughs> this is the digital level what is the difference between auto level and digital level see auto level doesn't have this uh, display and function keys right but digital level have function keys and display this is the display these all are the function keys function keys that is a major difference right they are not very popular <coughs> instead auto levels are more extensively used see nowadays digital levels are there but we are not using that much when we compare it to the auto level auto levels we are using because because uh, they are a very popular nowadays right in future definitely we are going for only digital levels right clear right so here <coughs> this is the digital level right if you want to take the data you take this all data right clear simple pass the video and take the notes right clear next <coughs> total station already we discussed about uh, uh, total station in the previous video right if you doesn't see that up to now please watch that video then you will get some idea right so here already we discussed about that so here total station is made with et plus edm edm means electromagnetic distance measurement et means electronic theodolite right with the combined uh, with these two the total station will form right features already we discussed about this right already we discussed right digital display EDM is fitted inside the telescope right so gives the position of your point with respect to the point means <coughs> with the help of base point we can determine the position of the point see with respect to x distance with respect to y y axis and with respect to z axis we can determine right with respect to x axis with respect to y axis with respect to z axis we can determine the position of any object in the space in the space most accurate and user friendly right total station for the <coughs> surveying work right clear right on board memory to store data compatibility with computers right means we can connect the total station with the computer directly we are getting the maps right if you want this data please pause the video and take all the uh, points if you need right clear <clears throat> uses already we discussed about uses also right total station is used for uh, general purpose angle measurement distance measurement control surveys detail mapping right setting out works all these works we can use right already we discussed all these already we discussed in the previous video right clear already we discussed all about this point right next robotics uh, total station also we discussed right so here robotics discretion this is the uh, advanced one advanced one so here automatically operated by itself right so here no need of manpower if we will use a robotic or uh, total station no need of a manpower right so automatically automatically predetermined the direction and focuses automatically at target at specified distance right clear 
can be integrated with GPS also, right? With the help of G uh, means here uh, GPS also fixed in within it. This is the advantage of robotic total station. Nowadays, uh, this type of uh, total stations are uh, not very popular, but uh, normally we are using total stations like uh, different different companies like uh, Pentax like that, right?